So it's early morning here, just taking a little stroll along the Awash River. Some of the hiking group are swimming in Awash, which is looking lovely, but there's quite a few crocodiles here, so I'll probably be skipping the morning swim and just observing from the banks. It's very, very peaceful, very, very beautiful, as you can see. The tour guide yesterday was telling us that Awash River is actually the longest river in Ethiopia. I didn't know that. It's really, really beautiful. I have to come back here and explore more of the National Park. We are in the southernmost point of the National Park where the waterfall, the biggest waterfalls are. That's called Awash Lodge Falls. And then now we're just going to have breakfast and we're going to go up to the north to another lodge called Duha Lodge and there's some natural springs, they've got a swimming pool and it's right on a lake it's actually owned by the same person so that should be pretty cool loads of birds here, we've seen loads of baboons, loads of monkeys I'll post some of the pictures too loads of crocodiles in the falls yesterday, we counted about 13 so that was pretty epic too we haven't seen any other big animals yet they do have a little museum here with loads of stuffed dead animals but we kind of skipped the filming on that one it's been a beautiful little trip. Yeah, looking forward to going up to the north part of Awash now. I'll keep you posted and let you know. I'll leave you with these beautiful footage of the riverbanks of Awash. It's the night after the party before, yeah. Yeah. but these lot were smashed. Yeah. I wasn't Not there. Me. I went Not to me. bed early. Not me. These lot were all absolutely wasted. But we got a nice interesting story. Interesting story. Yeah. What happened, Mr. Holland? So this is Colin's reporting live for BBC. The thing I'm going to tell you is true, and no one will believe that the baboons came and marauded me at night. It was deep late when all of them were all drunk and they didn't know about what was going on but suddenly I heard something coming. I, mean, I thought first of all it was a baboon, okay. you know? Was it a baboon or a monkey? I didn't know. No clue. All of them were damn asleep. Someone was snoring. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. There we go. That's better. And that's the proof. That's the proof. The proof, gonna... the proof in the pudding is, we'll post the pictures later, but... Basically... Then they just left, uh, the baboon left a very good... Uh, Leaving present all over the tent. It's called their wash present. <laughs> there you go. We'll so be right back after the break. Now. So we're moving all the way to Brazil. What do you say? Vamos. 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 <laughs> it was a good night. Good night. Good Give day. thanks. Did you sleep well? You. Everybody sleep well? Mm -hmm. Did you yeah. sleep well, Matt? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you did. I didn't. I didn't sleep well, man. I'm <laughs> going home to bed. But it's been a good adventure. I wash. so many more adventures beautiful. to come though. Yes. Thank you. Oh, One loading soon before Canning. the rain season. Woo. We're going to the hot yeah. springs now in Doha Lodge. Doho. Here we come. Doha, not Doha. 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 Thank you. All right, that's the end of the report. <laughs> See you soon. Bless. Leaving the campsite, we are all very, very tired. With one more trip left, we're going to Doha, Flua, Doha, Flua, which is Natural Hot Springs Resort. It's about an hour drive from here because we are in the south by Awash Lodge Falls, and Doha, Doha is in the north. So it's about an hour through the park. Might see some animals on the way. Hopefully, try not to fall asleep. That's the end of the campsite. Fire still burning. That's it for now, guys. Ciao for now. Oh, here we come. <laughs> Hold it, 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 hold it
Whoa. It's hot as well. It's like 30 degrees already. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. We're on our way out. Not too far on the rocky road. We just got to Doha Lodge. It is so hot out here. It's crazy hot. It's like the desert. I think it's like 35, 36, 37. It was very long. Uh, but I think it's going to be worth it when we get there. It's beautiful natural spring pools and natural springs on a lake and traditional rooms as well. Behind me is a traditional hut. We'll find out what's going on now. Let's go and find these natural fluids, natural springs. <laughs> Like what we got to do. Is it hot? Mukat? Wait, 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 wait. I was in there. It's hot springs. Chop. It's woody. The woody bridge. Loads of springs everywhere. I don't know where the swimming pool is, bro. Found a spot. This is the spot where we got to eat. Hello! We're going the long way around. We're going this way around. Let me take a nice one from that field. How are we going to get up there? We're going all the way around. This is the springs. This is where we at, G. This is where we at. Whee! This is Doha Springs, yo. On the lake. I'm going to have to jump in. Let me get my trunks on. 
and jump in this hot natural spring water. It's gonna cool me down, hopefully. May it make me hotter either. Let's find out. When Ferengis go wild, I told them don't jump in. There's crocodiles, there's hippos, Romariale, but they decided to swim in Awash Lake. Ferengis, eh? They never play by the rules. South Africans, Brazilians, Ferengis, they're always being naughty. I'm a bit scared for the first time. I don't know about it. Sink it for a second. Naughty. I only live once, right? Hold it, film it, bro. Okay. I'm gonna jump. Okay, <laughs> I dived in, but I just missed this part. You only live once, right? I'll see you on the other side. Uh, we're gonna find some gumari. Ah? Uh? No. <laughs> there is no gumari. Gumari, Ale. No, Ale. Really? No. 